As we tend to have past lives, to remember past lives, and more and more people are these days, I find in my work that reincarnation is more the human experience. Animals may also, and in many spiritual traditions, there are concepts of animal reincarnation. And I do believe that animals reincarnate. But I think when you've reached human form, you don't get sent back into an animal as a punishment or something like that. Although I, that may happen, and it's possible that we don't remember our animal lifetimes because of different species, or maybe that's not uh, capable of being retrieved through the normal memory techniques. But I find that when a person is a human, they tend to stay a human and work through their karma, their situation, their learning in that manner. That's how we learn along this spiritual journey. The concept of reincarnation, at least in part to me, is that you have more than one chance to get it correct. We're evolving along this spiritual pathway. It's really learning about love and compassion and kindness. We know these things, these spiritual lessons, how to feel less fear, less hate, less prejudice. We know what these things are, but we're kind of a stubborn species. It takes us more than one chance, more than one time to get it right. How can you learn everything in one time? And I believe we have many lifetimes to learn these lessons as we're evolving along our spiritual path where we do not have to come back here anymore. We've graduated or we can choose to come back voluntarily and help others to uh, progress along their spiritual journey too. And we do that. But I also believe there are many other dimensions, higher dimensions, and we continue our learning in these higher dimensions too unless you choose to come back here as a kind of teacher and help others.